Hello and welcome to a brand new video of Global Techniques of Architecture. And into today's video, we are going to discuss something about, say, creating an acoustic space. So there are many myths and uh, say misconceptions in consultant fraternity that how to go for 100% acoustic. Believe me, if somebody says that he is giving you a 100% acoustic uh, wall, he is kind of bluffing. Because there is nothing uh, such thing that can create a 100% acoustic cabin or a 100% acoustic room. So what I suggest is be wise and go for uh, a perfect selection of glass even for internal partitions. So uh, it's, a, it's a misbelief or say a marketing gimmick that has uh, taken place past these many years that even a double glass unit or a insulated glass unit can perform two acoustic functions. Of course, there would be some reductions, but those reductions are not at all considerable when it comes to creating an acoustic space. So, because the sound travels into longitudinal layers, so these layers have to have some sort of uh, different thicknesses of the material that they pass through. The thickness, the density has to be different. So what there is uh, a air cavity, you have two glasses inside a la DGU or say an insulated glass unit. But when it comes to a laminated glass, it performs much better. So I'll request next time when you go for acoustic treatment, go for a laminated glass or else uh, laminated glass if you have an issue about the pricing part and if at all you are uh, creating an internal space just for the MD for a conference uh, room. So there is again a second cheat code available wherein we have two light of glasses placed between uh, and we form a cavity of more than 50 mm to create that space and these two lights would be performing to this that this won't allow this uh, the sound propagation through this layer the cavity will absorb some amount of sound and then you have uh, the uh, second or say the last layer i'll request my friend to show you this detail this is the detail i'm talking of so here you see these two glasses these two layers and a cavity of 50 mm. This is very, very, very popular into uh, say international companies who have come to India like uh, uh, to just name a few, few banks uh, have this detail for the conference rooms. So if at all you are intending to do this uh, for a acoustic room or say a sound recording room, if at all you are going for a sound recording room, this these two lights have to be laminated glasses with a cavity of plus 50 to 100 mm. Only then we can achieve the desired one. And not to miss, this is my favorite swing. We are looking out for this similar detail. If you find it anywhere, do comment nearby on the comment section. And nearby Mumbai, I would come to you and just take it off. Believe me, this detail has to be for free. You're not paying it for. So that's the end of this video for acoustic uh, purpose, acoustic understanding for all my viewers. I hope you like it. Once again, thanks for watching.